Wow, I sure do love Minecraft PvP. This guy's getting destroyed. Good fight, man. Uh, I'm gonna go use the bathroom, bro. I'll be right back. What the heck? Hey, I'm back, fam. Uh, dude, what are you doing? You've been hacking this whole time? I can't believe it. You let your fans down, you let me down, Bunny down. Listen, man, it's, it's not what you think, I promise. Like, let me just explain it to you. I'm about to make an exposed video on you, fam. Listen, bro, I promise. It's not it's not what you think it is. Just lay down. Let me tell you the full story. So I was one of wanting someone and I was destroying him. When suddenly, my hand just started spazzing out from jitter clicking. <sighs> like, the pain was so bad, I literally died. So I thought being a ghost would be cool, so I tried it out for a bit. Bro, is that me? Am I that ugly? Oh my hey, get up, bro. Get up. All right, let's see here. <laughs> I got bored quickly and went back into my body. But my jitter clicking was never the same. From that day forward, I haven't been able to jitter click over two CPS and it's been terrible. All right, so there's a common misconception that jitter clicking will get you HIV, it will give you arthritis, it will basically just do terrible things to your hands, and I'm here to say that that possibly is false. I don't think it will get any form of arthritis or hurt your hand if you're jitter clicking the right way, and as long as you're not jitter clicking for like 10,000 years and doing like 40 CPS. Like when I first started jitter clicking, it obviously hurt, and then once I got used to it, it didn't hurt at all, so now I'm like perfectly fine. For some reason, people think something's gonna happen to your hand. Honestly, there is a slight chance something could happen, but I really doubt it. Like, I'm jitter clicking, so you know, if something does happen, then rip. But no, I seriously doubt that anything bad will happen. And actually, there's this one guy who broke his hand a while ago on HG Teams, you know, an HCF faction server. He broke his hand and he was actually forced to auto click. So if I ever broke my hand, you guys already know what I'm about to do. You know, actually, I'm not 100% sure this guy's hand broke. <laughs> he might have just been auto clicking, but you know, he just said his hand broke, so. You know, maybe it didn't. Maybe it was lying so he could auto-click because, you know, he was, he was too bad to click. So, yeah, I definitely don't advise auto-clicking in Minecraft because, you know, Cheat Breaker coming out 2030. So, you guys better be hyped for that. Not for all the... I don't get the point in cheating in Minecraft. Like, it's a game to play to have fun. So, why are people cheating just so they can get to, like, to the top of the leaderboards? Dude, I don't understand. Like, let me tell you guys. Two years ago, there was, like, no cheaters on any PvP server. Like, the most people would do is auto-click and you would get caught and banned, like, so quick. You know, there were no ghost clients, and maybe if you were hacking, you would be using, like, freaking Hazuni or something. And everyone you fought was legit. Like, imagine how cool that was. And then rumors of ghost clients started coming around, and no one really believed it, because, like, how does that even make sense? How could you have a client and you not being able to see it on your screen? But little did we know, it was actually a true thing. <laughs> and only a few people had ghost clients back then. Like, I think, honestly, only one or two people. And then this guy uploaded a video saying he was selling them. So many people were buying them, it was crazy. And then the server I used to play on, Koei, got infested by cheaters. And that pretty much led to the server getting shut down and the Minecraft PvP community basically like split up from there. And then, you know, they sold it to Badline for like $2, which is kind of like a creepy UI, only $2. And then from there, uh, it's been downhill. <laughs> what else can I do with these powers? The bag, it's floating. 